Ken, it's great to meet you here at the Leicester Space Park. I was wondering if you could tell me how exciting is the opening of the Space Research Centre to you personally and also to the city as a whole? Well, we've been doing space research at the university for 60 years. We've had the, a very successful outreach facility at the National Space Centre, which is, uh, must have inspired hundreds, if not thousands, of local children to, at least, if not space, be looking for a career in science and engineering. And I think the space park just completes the whole local facility in having the ability to actually build small satellites and, and, and get them into orbit. Leicester obviously has had a great background in space research and has been involved in important projects in the past. What is the city actually involved with at the moment and what kind of research will be taking place? Earth observation, the ability to look at the Earth and monitor what's happening from space, and also planetary science. So we now have a significant program at the university in directly exploring the planets like Jupiter, Saturn, Mercury. So Ken, why Leicester? It is historical. Um, and it does go back to the time in 1960 when the UK space program based in universities was expanding and there needed to be a new university space group that was involved in X-ray observations, in particular the X-ray emission from the sun that was known to control the heating of the upper atmosphere. Uh, that was the subject of my PhD at UCL. And it, looking around for somewhere that we could get our instruments calibrated it turned out Leicester University Physics Department was the place so the contact was made and really everything developed from there the um, it was obviously an area of expansion so the government decided that they would fund another university so Leicester University was the obvious choice in that area of looking at space radiations uh, so I came here and, and basically everything has developed from there.